I'm Peter Tatchell, and here are some of Pink 60's top political stories for 2011. The United Nations made its first ever criticism of Iran's treatment of LGBT people in November. It called for the repeal of all anti-gay legislation in Iran, which imposes the death penalty for same-sex behavior. Early this month, openly gay Elio de Rupo was elected as Belgium's prime minister. He's the world's second out gay national leader. President Obama, addressing the United Nations on Palestinian statehood, urged all countries to stand up for gay rights. He said no country should deny people their rights because of who they love. Ruth Davidson was elected as leader of the Scottish Conservatives a few weeks ago. This makes her the first ever openly lesbian leader of a British political party. And finally, Poland swore in its first openly gay MP last month. Robert Bedron of the left-wing Pelikop movement was elected on a platform of anti-discrimination alongside the country's first transgender MP, Anna Grodzda. Those are a few of the top political stories of 2011. Join us again tomorrow.